like we always do at this time. After tonight, don't bring Bushy around me. He's a hun for real. Ask that nigga for bad. <laughs> Listen, y'all. It's a lot could be said on this video, right? It's a whole lot could be said. That nigga said something about blue. That boy called his brother the cable man. Said he was out here hanging up mounts. So TQ, I heard that you good at hanging up TV mounts. Could you please come hook my TV mount up for me, brother? I heard that that's what you good at. And they said you really ain't have a job to boost. He gave you one. Now let me tell y'all. Y'all know. Straight like that. Y'all know we've been on a, on a long road with Boosie. Boosie feel like everybody hate him except for Vlad. That's his buddy. He's cooler with Vlad than he is with his own than he is with his own brother. His own brother. But that's cool. That's cool. That ain't my fucking business. I'm just being nosy right now because that's what the fuck I sit here and do. Who don't like what I do? Yeah, that's what I sit over here and I do. I talk my shit. So I'm talking my shit. But let me explain something about Boosie. Shouts out to Duke the Jewel. I see a lot of his jewelry popping back up on, on, on Boosie Neck these days. I ain't even going to get into that. I just seen him at the jewelry store cashing in some jewelry not too long ago. Looked like Duke's jewelry. Some extravagant pieces. But you know what? It is what it is. Who am I? Let me mind my business. I don't want to point no fingers at nobody and have nobody getting indicted off YouTube. You know what I'm saying? Because these motherfuckers out here trying to indict people nowadays off YouTube videos. They got AK-47, Seti Nas, Academics, all y'all boys out there indicting people on the videos. That bitch, y'all, they don't know they doing it, but they just using their videos. Like, look what he said. Man, we just saw here brainstorming, nigga. It ain't that because we saying it because we're trying to case people up. We just brainstorming on the internet. It's on the internet anyway. Why can't we talk about it as black people? Our culture. We're not even allowed to talk about our culture, but Vlad is. Boosie, cut it out. Now, let me explain something. Remember that time when, when Boosie was in that thing with Duke the Jeweler? He was walking around with his shirt off. We was like, why would Boosie be walking around with some boxes with his shirt off around all these gentlemen? Listen to what Boosie asked his OG to do with him. And I'm going to leave this video right here real short. Listen. Pop fireworks right now, bitch. I keep fireworks. OG, take a shot with me, nigga. I'm a little bit flabbergasted there. He said, OG, take a shower with me, nigga. I keep firework. OG, take a shower with me, nigga. I'm going to leave it right there. I'm going to leave it right there. Certain things you can say. That's like King Von video surface. The boy said, hey, man, I'm gay. They mad because I'm gay. Da, da, da. And he wasn't being funny. He wasn't being hilarious. He was talking to the guards. Let me tell you something. You don't play with those guards in jail like that. So he couldn't have just been playing with them and saying that because they would have been like, yo, bro, stop playing before I throw your ass somewhere for real. Uh, they would have said some shit. They, they, they looked like they knew what time it was. They knew what he was into. But people would say they didn't want to believe that. But I'm, I'm sure that these same people believe in that King Von set up Lil Dirk now. Cut it the fuck out. I'm going to say this on every video I make so far until I get my point across. I want to hear one of these bloggers say my name. Be like, Kaz, we hear you. Because I never want nobody else on my page to ever recite the words that came out of Seti Nash's mouth about King Von told on Dirk. We had never believed that in a million, billion years. You need more people. You need more proof. And you can't tell me that just because his, his charge was dropped two days before Dirk, that makes him the, the, the prime suspect. And that man was dead two years when his charge got dropped. The only person they was talking to was Dirk ass. They wasn't talking to no fucking King Von. But then you got Boosie running around here asking a man to take a shower with him. Asking a man. A man. That's a man, Buddha. Buddha. Buddha, that's a man, Buddha. Downtown. Downtown. And put him back up out of Katrina Glyph. <laughs> Bitch, I'll pop fireworks right now, bitch. I keep fireworks. OG, take a shot with me, nigga. Oh, yeah. 
Now, I'll let the video play a little bit longer because I want you to hear. He didn't say, nah, I'm just playing. I just wanted y'all to hear. He ain't say, nah, I'm just playing, OG. I'm going to let him talk some more because I don't know about you. You stop the video. I just told bitch, bitch, I go, bitch, my legs get tired, I jump in the elevator. Yeah, bitch, my legs get tired, I jump in the elevator. Fuck you talking about. School! We tore up already. Come here, school. We tore up already. Come here, school. We tore up already. I don't know. Yeah, you really tore up. You told that man to get in the shower with you, but hey, who? Now, I'm gonna let y'all hear what he allegedly called Blue. I don't know. I'm going to call you Rainbow Bootsy. After you told the OG to come get in the shower, which I said, come take a shower with me, nigga. Now, what the fuck do that mean, nigga? You ain't in no goddamn penitentiary, nigga. You ain't in no boys' locker room, boy. Tell that man come take a shower with you. But listen to what he said about Blue. Bitch, don't play with, don't me. Play with me. I'm ready to argue with you bitches right, right now. I'm talking about the talk cable about guy. The cable guy. Uh, 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 Rainbow, Rainbow Blue. Blue. Nigga, wife called my sissy. Call she knows something. Know something. She found the one of them Found dicks in that motherfucking DM. Don't get me Don't started. Get me started. Don't get, if your, if your wife call you a sissy, 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 she knows something. She knows something. And one thing, know. she knows something, man. You be, your wife knows something. She done found the dick in that DM. Y'all won't fuck with me. Who won't fuck with me? You want to go to war with me? I'll take you to war. You want to fucking go to war with me? I'll take you to war. Now, hold up, y'all. We got to be real here. What y'all think about Boosie's new album? He just dropped this and his brothers and shit. The way he was out there fishing. Man, that nigga got some hot tracks on that bitch, y'all. I ain't going to hold you. Boosie got a hot fucking album out here. Calling his brother the cable man. Called Blue, Rainbow Blue. And then that's the OG to take a shower with him. Hey, goddamn, it's a little bit too much going on on here for me. It's your boy Casa Don, man. Thank you to my moderators. Thank you to my subscribers. Thank you to everybody who take their time and hit that like button for me, man. That shit takes me in the algorithms. I'm not there anymore, but you know, when I was there, thank you. It was fun. It was nice when I was there. I could be like Michael Jackson when it comes to them algorithms. Do you remember the time of 104 motherfucking K? Man, I did some videos last night. I was a little tipsy, though, so I don't know what all I said. I did a lot. But, you know, it's all good. Whatever I said, I meant it. So I, I don't think I said nothing that I said I'll take back today. But, yo, what y'all think about that? Y'all think Boosie was being funny? Well, he asked the OG to take a shower with him. And do you think that, what do you think that Rainbow, oh, damn, Rainbow. What do you think Blue Wife meant when she was calling him out his character? I don't know. But like, share, subscribe. This beef ain't going nowhere, but somebody going to get hurt. And I think that's going to end up being Boosie because they try to turn a lot of people against Boosie right now. But I'm going to tell y'all just from, I I'm not being funny. So far. Boosie got one of the hottest albums out right now when it comes to a lot of these rappers. Like, I heard, I heard some shit on the radio. I was like, what the fuck is this nigga saying? What the fuck? And then it's so eyes. And I got my, I got my, I never know eyes. What the fuck, man? What happened to hip hop, nigga? Y'all niggas flip flop. Hip hop not my culture, so I'm gonna talk about it. Hip hop your culture, I feel bad for you. Because how is hip-hop your culture and you never owned a stake in it? How is hip-hop your culture when it's owned by a bunch of Jewish gentlemen? No disrespect to them. Do your thing. Do your thing. But those Jewish gentlemen, like, like especially the one that got Dr. Dre, shit, he was out there rocking with Bruce Springsteen. Born in the USA. I was born in the USA. That boy was out there since them days. Now that took over our so-called culture. And I'm going to tell you again, 
we lost hip hop when they left out the park and stopped doing it in the dark. Hip hop set out in the park. We used to do it out in the dark. Not no more. You gotta do it in the lit studio with a bunch of perverts watch you and smack you in your penis and grabbing your private parts and bending you over and anal canaling you for a record deal. Enjoy that life. I don't want it. Thank you to everybody who listened to your boy. This is your boy, Costa Don. Salute, cop back, shoot. Be back on the BS. I'm gone.